John, congratulations. Thank What's you. it feel like to win your fourth Premier League title in a row? Uh, it's um, honestly surreal. I, honest, I didn't think I'd, I'd win one in, in my career. Never mind six and four in a row. Uh, treble, all the things that have come in so far in my career. Um, it's incredible. It's such a strange feeling. I think the duration and the ups and downs within the season that get you to this point and is so close. I think it's been a, quite a emotionally good end to the season in, in the respect of we've been here before knowing the pressures of, of what um, is needed out of this game um, right down to the you know the final game and one, wanting three points and fighting Arsenal so that us being in that situation before I think has helped us be calmer more um, prepared in, in within this situation and uh, obviously the outcome is just incredible so yeah absolutely thrilled I think everyone's just played such a major part within within the team without it throughout the season and um, it's never plain sailing but we get here at the end and that's the main thing what is with this team is there any ever any doubt that you can't win everything no I think we're a bit up, upset to be honest that we didn't go further in the Champions League this season um, I think we set the bar so high and we set our dreams uh, out on the table at the start of the season once we start gaining momentum within the competitions um, we kind of feel that we can we can go and do that and when we don't it's, it's difficult you know uh, we hit the heights of last season winning a treble and it's only been done once before if we wanted to you know uh, do it again this season it's not happened but we've got a great chance to win another trophy in, uh, in a week's time and see where it takes us What's the difference between John Stones that signed for Manchester City and the one that's standing right in front of me now? Older. <laughs> no. Um, I think a lot more uh, mature, a lot more prepared, a lot more scars that are on my body mentally as well, which is, I say that in a good way, but you can't progress without, without failure, without bad times, without... Um, you know, going through really tough moments and I think the person I am today I don't think I would have dreamt I could be as strong and as um, I don't know I've not got the word but as as as, as I am today I suppose and um, I'm extremely proud of what I've achieved uh, so far Extre extremely proud of uh, the bad and good moments through the, through uh, through the years and extremely proud for my family, you know, to, to be able to give them these memories and these moments that not many people get to get to live. So yeah. Finally, Vincent Company said a couple of years ago, winning back to back is really, really tough. How does Pep keep you going every year? How does he change like, continue that momentum? Well, he doesn't he doesn't let you rest. I think um, I think his his desire and his uh, his workload, his work rate. Um, outshines anyone I think he's his passion for the game for new ideas for winning um, just transcends between us as a team you know it's really difficult to uh, to have that I think it's born it's 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 grown within someone and to be able to pass that on to us as players is uh, is a special talent and I think you know, he just wants more, <laughs> and I'm sure he'll be looking, to, he'll uh, celebrate for, I don't know, maybe tonight, maybe not, but he'll be looking forward to the game next week, next Saturday. Thanks for your time, mate. Enjoy the rest of the night. Thank you so much. <laughs> Good to see you again. Good to see you, mate. Well done, mate. Well done, mate. Did you enjoy that? There's so much more, so why not hit subscribe and download the Optus Sport app.